Paula, thank you. Tonight, our team getting answers after growing outrage over that life-saving drug and the sticker shock we reported on last night here. From $18 a tablet jumping to $750 a tablet, up 4,000% in just 24 hours, the anger aimed at one man, the 32-year-old hedge fund manager behind the price hike, defiant until now. ABC's Lindsay Davis tracking him down with the ABC News exclusive tonight. Overnight, headlines turned Martin Shkreli into the most hated man in America after he raised the price of Daraprim more than 4,000 percent. What do you say to your critics, to people who say you're just being greedy? I think they have a fundamental misunderstanding of uh, the way companies operate. At this price, Daraprim is not a substantially profitable drug. That 4,000 percent increase got the attention of Hillary Clinton. She called it outrageous and today demanded change. You won't have to pay more than $250 a month for covered medications. But tonight, this 32-year-old CEO telling ABC News exclusively he's heard the public outcry. We've agreed to lower the price of Daraprim to a point that is more affordable and is able to uh, allow the company to make a profit, but a very small profit. And we think these changes will be welcomed. Shkreli says they still need to determine the cost, but he reiterates they already give half of it away for free or a dollar. For everyone else, he promises it'll be less than $750 a pill. Lindsay Davis, ABC News, New York.